At first, I didn't believe it. I'll, I'll admit that I work for a university called Nihon University in Tokyo. My job is historian, researcher, and also a language teacher. Yasuke is pretty well known in Japan. He's not known by everybody. He was taken as a slave, as a boy, almost definitely from what is now South Sudan. He gained his freedom. Valiano took him as his bodyguard to Japan. In Japan, he causes a sensation. The most powerful warlord in Japan demands to see who's disturbing his peace. He adapts to the situation. He manages somehow. The Japanese sources say he has a fantastic demeanor. Then Nobunaga throws a party for him. At the end of this party, he's made a rich man. He's given 37 kilos of copper coins. He spoke very good Japanese, according to the sources. He was employed he was given a sword, he was given a residence, he was given servants of his own, and he was given a stipend, an income. That's why we say he's the first foreign samurai. He goes into battle with Nobunaga twice, possibly three times. Two of those, we have definite evidence that Yasuke was there. 